I feel good headed into this attempt. After several delays and setbacks, the Artemis 1 team is hopeful Wednesday will be the day they finally get the Mega Moon rocket off the ground. The mission aims to eventually take humans to the moon for the first time in more than 50 years. Artemis is our new set of missions within NASA, where we will land the first woman and the first person of color on the moon in just a few years. Issues with a faulty temperature sensor and a liquid hydrogen leak scrubbed the first two launch attempts, forcing crews to stow away the rocket and capsule for several weeks. And then weather also played a major role. If Wednesday's launch attempt is a success, it will be a major milestone for NASA. As astronauts hope to collect lunar samples and map the mysterious southern region of the moon when the crewed spacecraft launches expected in 2024. So it's going to be a much different terrain for them to have to navigate, for them to have to keep the rover safe, keep themselves safe. It's been a long road for the Artemis 1 launch. First, Hurricane Ian in September, then Hurricane Nicole hit last week, causing several issues. Caulking came loose on the spacecraft. Water leaked into the crew access arm, which astronauts would need to use to board the capsule. And there was a rip in the rain cover, which protects one of the rocket's engines. But now, NASA seems to think their third launch attempt may be the charm. It takes a lot of technology and a lot of operations and a lot of people to make this possible. In Florida, I'm Ivan Rodriguez.